Hi there, so in this video, I'm going to quickly show you the steps on how to easily place the lights in the scene. And it's just an alternative way of uh, placing your lights in the scene as opposed to using the three D gizmos like the move tool, the rotate, and the scale. This is how we would normally do it when you want to place the lights in the scene. Let's say we want to place it on the left side of the cat, then we would rotate it and use a move gizmo like this. And uh, that usually works, but as you can see there, right there, I just tried to move it around, but I accidentally scaled it by click dragging one of the corners. And that scaled the light instead of moving it. So um, yeah, that works, but this is not as easy as when we look through the selected light. And by that, I mean we would look through the selected light and navigate from there as if we are navigating using the perspective camera view. So the first step is to press N and then go to View tab, check this uh, local camera, and then pick that light in the scene. Second step is to enable this camera to view, and then when that's done, I'll press zero so through that selected light. Now, as you can see, it's now looking through that light, selected light. And uh, if you see, you find yourself in this weird angle, then just uh, sometimes it does that by default. So what you would do is to just zero in the rotation Y. So there you go. So now, and it's a it's now in, uh, in a normal behavior. Now it behaves as expected. So there, as you can see, I'm rotating it, looking through that light. And this is the perspective view. So I just split the screen into three parts. And this one would be the render preview. This is the perspective preview. And oh, uh, I only have uh, three. I should say um, elements in the 3D scene like this light, this camera, and this cat. So there you go, that's how you would do it. And if you want to add another light, then just shift. Oh, if you want to snap out of this light, you just simply have to click anywhere outside of the uh, object or any of these objects. Click anywhere here and then just press zero and now you snap out of that. Uh, looking through that selected light. And the same thing if you want to uh, another if you want to look through another light and just shift a light uh here like now we have a new light in the scene so now as you can see they just try to move it around and i happen to uh press the corner so i scaled it unintentionally so that's a disadvantage of uh, using this uh, gizmo tool and placing the light so just press n same thing Deselect that and then select the light local camera, enable this, and then select pick that a uh, new create newly created light, which is this one. And then the second one would be camera to view. And then third is press, third step is press zero. And now you're now looking through that light. If you want to frame that and just do it this way, so uh just navigate. Um, and you can see the how the light moves right there, and this and this here too. So there you're uh, navigating this as if you're uh, navigating a three D uh, using the perspective view camera. So that's it. I hope this helps, and uh, thanks for watching. See you in the next video.